How to use such? Let me show you. Such equals like that. For example, um, that car over there, the red one. I want a car like that. So that refers to the car over there. I want such a car. It's the same thing. I want a such car. Very uncommon to say it like that. I want such a car. That is definitely elegant. You could say it like that. But most native speakers would say, I want a car like that. I don't like to use like that. I like to use such. Such a word as such is more clear than like that because like that can be confused for the verb like. It's not a like, no, no, no. It is similar. Such equals similar to that. Let's do some more examples. Such a comedian. Uh, sh she is funny. So, she is funny the same as a comedian. Is there a way to make this clear? Like a comedian, she is funny. All right, but such is stronger because such already means the same as. Whereas like, you see, it doesn't have that pizzazz. It doesn't have that strength. So let's use such. Similar to a comedian, she is funny. Would you like to stay in a place like that? Like what? Uh, a beautiful hotel? Would you like to stay in a place like that? Would you like to stay in a campsite? Is that the kind of place you would like to stay? What such place would you like to stay in? So I can ask that as a question. Or would you prefer to stay in? What such place would you prefer to stay in? Well, I would prefer the Hilton Hotel. Or I would prefer the cheap 100 baht guest house. Whatever, whatever it is that you prefer, whatever such place you would like to stay. All right, so such, such equals similar to. In this sentence here, what such place? Would you prefer to stay in? It's similar to asking. It's such as asking, what kind of place would you like to stay? Would you prefer to stay in? All right, so asking what kind, whenever you say what kind, like what kind of car, a car similar to what? What such car would you like? Now, do we usually say this in English? What such place, instead of what kind of, what such place would you prefer to stay in? Well, we could say that. Yes, it, it is a bit unusual, but you can speak unusually, all right? You're not oppressed from speaking in clear terms. And I like the word such, and therefore, as a native speaker, I advise that you use such to equal similar to or same as something else, or, and this one I hate, like something else. Because like should just not be in here. In fact, let's get rid of like. Like is so lazy, you know. Well, it's like a uh, man. No, no, we're not having that. We're not having it. Uh, it's such as, it's such as the flowers in the spring, this wonderful smell from outside. Yes, it must be May right now, all right? Because it's similar to the smell of flowers in May. Well, I hope you enjoyed that video. I didn't live stream it. It's just a uh, boring grammar video, but don't forget to like and subscribe. Thank you so much.